Chrissy Teigen opening up Monday on Medium, Instagram, and Twitter to address the controversy that caused her to ghost from social media over the past month. Breaking her silence, writing, It has been a very humbling few weeks. I've been sitting here in a hole of deserved global punishment. And I was a troll, full stop, and I am so sorry. Mark Malkin from Variety says it's honest and raw, true Tegan fashion. She tells it like it is. Um, she, you know, she talks about her good times and her bad times, some very tragic times. Um, so to, to read this apology, I really heard her voice in there. I do believe that this apology is real, but at the same time with this apology, have come if she hadn't been called out on it. That's the big question here. Tegan writes, I'm no longer the person who wrote those horrible things. I grew up, got therapy, got married, had kids, got more therapy. Celebs like Zoe Saldana, Jennifer Garner, and husband John Legend showing her love. The scandal started last month when old tweets began surfacing. Model and artist Courtney Stodden says the model and mogul bullied them with messages like, go to sleep forever and I hate you, to the then 16-year-old. Chrissy apologized on May 12th. But within days, stores like Macy's and Target appeared to have dropped the cookware line bearing Tegan's name. Bloomingdale's reportedly pulling out of their retail deal with the star, and Tegan was removed from the commercial marketing for the new Safely Cleaning brand she founded with Kardashian star Kris Jenner. Then this month, she withdrew from a scheduled Netflix appearance. She now says she will continue to take time away from social media to be with her family. Now, the people who are Chrissy haters, they're not going to move on, but guess what? They were Chrissy haters before this happened. Will she be getting the endorsement deals like she did? That'll be interesting. That'll, you know, time will tell if she does, because the question now is every time she does publicity for something, is this going to be brought up? Okay, so right before I went live with you guys, um, I checked. Twitter, I checked Instagram, and it appears Michael Costello, a designer from Project Runway, he just moments ago, hours ago, posted about his experience with Tegan accusing him of being racist and that that drove him to thoughts of harming himself. So this is unraveling in some uh, people's perspective. She had finished her online apology saying, I won't ask for your forgiveness, only your patience and tolerance and that you allow me to own past mistakes and be given the opportunity to seek self-improvement and change. And really, I mean, Rob and Marnie, you guys have kids. I think about parents all the time. The big lesson here is that we all have a responsibility about sharing strong opinions online.